as a South Louisiana native, love this place. If you've been out in the marsh, it is a gorgeous scene to see. So definitely want to preserve it. Water on the back of the uh, big trailer. I'm Taylor. Uh, I'm with Restore the Earth Foundation. Welcome to our planting site. We have a thousand trees, all native bald cypress. One person is going to be responsible for digging the hole. One is going to be responsible for putting the tree in. Chevron's been in the Gulf of Mexico for 85 years. I can't tell you how phenomenal it is to work for a company who really believes in protecting, preserving, and restoring. Um, we've also been able to donate land, 1,900 acres, to the Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries. Oh yeah, that was good. We're going to be planting a thousand trees today, but this entire project is going to fund 3.7 million trees. In fact, we've expanded the project from 8,800 acres to almost 19,000. The trees that will be planted this year and next year will generate 4.7 million tons of carbon credits, which we can then use to help offset the emissions from our base business that we're not able to abate ourselves. Chevron New Energies was only set up in 2021, and this is precisely why we set it up, to be able to invest in quality projects that will generate offsets that will permit us to reduce our own emissions and our customers' emissions. What we love about working with companies like Chevron is they're really putting their money where their mouth is. They're really meeting those landscape scale goals, which is how you get those critical restoration efforts to be successful. It has been a fabulous partnership. Just like the trees out there, we hope it matures and grows. We are uh, signing the donation today. I love that Chevron is in this space and and participating, so a good outcome for all and just a win all around.